Okay, guys, it's the zombie apocalypse. All the lights are out, your batteries are dead in your flashlight. You don't have any source of light, and it's getting dark out, and you need to get out of there. Find shelter soon before the zombies come out and you can't see them. So anyway, I'm going to show you how to make a torch. Very simple, very easy, very effective. Okay, let's get to it. So guys, first thing you want to do if you're going to make a torch is you have to find a good stick. Now the best kind of sticks to use are ones that are leafy, um, green, stuff that won't burn. So if it's a dead stick, it's going to burn when you set it on fire. But if it's leafy and green, it's not going to burn so easily. Uh, pardon my shirt, I got some stuff on it from the last video I made. Filming it in the same night. I'm not a weird hobo who keeps the same shirt on two days in a row. But anyways, let's go find a stick. Okay, so I found this in the woods. As you can see, it's still pretty green. It's turning brown, but it's still kind of wet and still kind of moist. So that means it'll work. I cut it down. Now what we want to do is this is way too big. This is like four or five feet, and we don't want it to be that long. So we've got to cut it down so it's the size of a torch. One thing you want to do is make sure you get off all these branches off the side so that you don't have it, so they don't get on, caught on fire and they're not hitting you in the face. So I'm going to cut off the branches and make it a little bit shorter, and then I'll see you after that. So guys, I cut off the branches from this. Um, anyways, what you want to do next is we're going to get the wrapping for the torch. What I did was I cut up an old t-shirt. Um... And I wrapped it around. You want to make sure it's tight, so it's not falling around, uh, not you know, flopping around. Because if it falls off, you're fucked. Um, but anyways, this is mine. That's kind of loose, so I got to fix that. But it's still a pretty decent wrapping. Now, what you want to do is you want to find some source of fuel. Because if you just leave this like that, first of all, it's going to take a long time to light. Then it's also going to take, a, it's going to burn really quickly, you know? So which is why you want to get fuel. Not only will it burn brighter, but it'll last longer too. Um, so anyway, for my fuel, I'm just using some W, not WD-40, some uh, lighter fluid. But you can use pretty much anything that's flammable, you know, vodka, WD-40, hairspray, gasoline. Just be careful, though, because this stuff is flammable, which means that it's real easy to fuck yourself up while doing it. So, safety first, and try not to start a forest fire if you're doing this. But anyway, I'm gonna go light this fire, or light this torch, so let's get down to it. So, guys, I lied. I am not actually using lighter fluid. I'm using lamp oil. Um, so, anyways, lamp oil probably works the best because it's thick which means it's going to set in. I think that's... Yep, that's lamp oil. All right, so use something thick. Lamp oil is what I'm using, which will probably work best. Um, soak it on there. Let it sit for a few minutes so it, you know, it really sets in. And then light that shit up. Let's do it. So we're just going to put some lamp oil on it. Should probably not film while I'm doing this. But whatever. Oh, fuck, I'm getting all my shoes. Sorry that I'm putting the camera down. Alright, I think it's all good now. So after you put that on there, just let it sit for like five minutes. Um, to let it soak in. But anyways, yeah. So, I'll see you when I light this up. Alright, I got the torch. Here we go. Works pretty good. Alright. Nice. Thanks for watching. Oh, shit.